guys, Chris again and welcome back to my channel. The item I'm going to do a quick review on today um, is from Louis Vuitton. Now in Glasgow, pretty much in the UK, this time of year is freezing cold. Like it's, oh I'm really dark. White again. Ah, give me a tan. So at this moment in time, it is freezing in the UK. I love this time of year because I can bring this item out. So guys, without flapping on, this is a quick review on the Cardiff scarf from Louis Vuitton. Okay, so guys, when I'm not using this scarf, I always keep it in a dust bag. Um, I'm not really too sure why, but I just keep it in this old style dust bag here that just says Louis Vuitton on it. And it's a top flip dust bag and out pops my Cardiff scarf. So firstly, this scarf is absolutely stunning it's just it's so nice i did have a scarf before that i sold because i wasn't i'm not really a navy kind of person i bought it purely because of the decoration and um, it was so nice but yeah i love this so much better so um how do i show you this so firstly when i open it out it has these gorgeous ruffly parts here just down there I absolutely adore these, they're so soft. On one side, you have the LV here, and on the other side, you have the Fleur de Lis. So, just to give you guys a close-up of the material on this thing, that's it there, as you can see, it's just so soft, and it just is so luxurious. And on the reverse side, you have the inverted colours. So you have this gorgeous dark grey, light grey, dark grey, light grey, dark grey um, design on the front of the side you would wear it out with, but on the behind of it, you just have the complete reverse. Light, dark, light, dark. And they are so beautiful. It's just so classy, regardless, regardless of what way you turn it, they look, they look great both ways. I always tend to wear it this way, and I'll show you how to wear it in a second. But the item itself is made in the UK, and I think that means it's made in Scotland, so um, that's great. <laughs> uh, the scarf is made of 75% lamb's wool, 25% angora, um, it's dry clean only, and as I said that it says made in the UK, and this here is the item number, M74205, and I think that is just the date code AB03135. I'm not too sure what AB means. And keep it with us. Okay, Yugi's Closet is always the best place to go to. If you're ever trying to authenticate anything. So, what did I say? AB. AB. Okay, so here we go. A O A A A H A. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> okay, it doesn't have an AB. Um, fuck. <laughs> oh, okay, I can't find the date code, but must be the UK because it's made in the UK. And yeah, that's that there. That's such a beautiful image. Wow. I do love this new phone, it's beautiful. Um, so there really isn't much to go through with this scarf, guys. As I said, it's it's a scarf or so. Um, but what I'll do is I'll insert some modelling shots of how I tend to wear the scarf and uh, so I really hope you found this video helpful and um, this is the beautiful Cardiff scarf it is Mm, it is just so soft. I absolutely adore this scarf. It smells like Melfa. Melfo? Right now. I do love the quality of this scarf. It is spectacular and it is just such a beautiful fabric. Um, I was more than happy to pay over what I usually would pay for a scarf because this is just so beautiful. Uh, I will leave the details of this scarf below if you guys want to purchase the scarf. 
again because the because LV have recently had another price increase this has gone up so much since I first bought it but I'll leave all the details for this below but um, guys thank you so much for watching the video today and I will see you in my next video take care bye bye thumbs up and don't forget oh, oh my god this is why I don't remove myself from the house